try to search from india and yeah. keep contacts here so that they can help you unfortunately they are completely understand you yeah. you'll have a huge difference in culture once hi hello everyone this is part the krishna welcome to my youtube channel canada krishna let's start our video today This is the second video of Vamsi's interview. So if at all you didn't see the first interview of the Vamsi, I'm having it in the iCard. Kindly go through the video once, then you can come to the part two so that you will understand complete information. The reason why we made this as a two parts, right? Because it is going beyond 20 minutes. We don't want to hold you for that long time. So that's the reason we made two different parts. So stay watching. Are you able to get any houses or if at all uh, you've gone through some experience, yeah, this, right? Th I have just been here one week and it has been a roller coaster ride this whole week. Okay. So first thing I'm going to suggest everyone is try to find a house when you're back in India and keep contacts here because there are many Indians like, uh, doing their graduations, undergraduations, yeah. MBA, etc. So they are living in uh, St. John's right now. So try I to keep contacts. So wherever province you are going through, right? Uh, yes, you can know. search in the Google or like in the LinkedIn mostly or in the YouTube. You can find a lot of people, uh, you know, uh, graduates who are actually doing there. Try reaching out to someone like if you reach out to at least 30 to 40 people, maybe one or two can respond to you, right? Sure, yes. Uh, that's how we came to know about Vamsi here. Uh, that's how I, I came to know about him. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. uh, Krishna and Rupesh, his roommates. They help me a lot. They, I'm still living with them. It's first week. I'm, I'm going out visiting houses. Yeah, yeah. So, it's, yeah, it's, it's like you know, uh, if at all uh, you have somebody who can take care of you, right? It becomes uh, easier it becomes uh, for easier, a couple yes. of days. But uh, believe me, guys, if you don't have anyone and if you're, you know, if you don't uh, have any way to go, don't think of you know coming here and then searching for the houses. So at least to book drop the option. Yeah. Drop that option of coming here and searching. Try to search from India. And yeah. keep contacts here so that they can help you. People living here will help you because they have gone through the same thing when they first arrived. Mm, right? yeah. so, so the reason we are helping moms here also, right? Uh, we had gone through a few struggles, so yes, exactly. I, we don't want uh, someone else to be going through that struggle. Exactly. Uh, so it's not like we can help everyone, but you know they have some issues. We can you know yes, try yes. to help them and also. Even I am ready to help now. And we are still finding houses, mm -hmm. but I think we almost got there. We almost got there. Okay. So can you let your Instagram handle? Uh, yeah, sure, you know, sure. I'll, I'll let. I'll let yeah. you know my Instagram sure. handle. I'll, I'll have the Wamsi's Instagram handle if at all you are. Is if you're... anyone having any doubts about oil and gas engineering or yeah, yeah. living and, in St. John's. Know, living in St. John's and some criteria or like, uh, you know, how can you proceed further with the oil and gas? Right? Yes, if you are like, you know, being in your plus two and you are trying to come for the oil and gas for your graduation also, yes. you can reach out to Wamsi. Please, 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 please. Mm -hmm. He has some knowledge, right? He can help you over there. You think I have some knowledge, right? <laughs> yeah, I think so because yeah. see, it's not that easy, uh, you know, writing gate and getting a good good rank over there. Uh, two ten is like something, right? So also your uh, CGPA is like uh, good enough, uh, eight point six. And you no, know, I think uh, whoever is coming to Canada, they should have a pretty much decent profile at least to come yeah. to Canada, right? Yeah. It's not like you know, uh, you can come by with any grade or no, not no. anything. So. Uh, so Vamsi, I want to ask one more question. Yes. Uh, so what about the GIC? Did you did you get the account opened? Uh, did you? Uh, what is the situation? You know, right this now? is winter going on, and the month of December. Yeah. Uh, there are holidays coming. Yeah. Because of that, I I did go to the branch. The mm -hmm. I, I have a GIC in CIBC. Mm -hmm. So there's a branch in Avalon Mall. Mm -hmm. So I I went there. I, I asked them to open mm -hmm. my activate my GIC account, but. Unfortunately, they are completely understaffed. I can see the whole cabin is empty. There is only two oh, people yeah. in the reception. I, I went them, I reached out to them, I asked them to open, activate my GAC. They said they are understaffed because of the holidays. They yeah, yeah, I understand because you know Christmas starts. Uh, you know, for them Christmas is like you know one month a whole <laughs> kind of yeah, thing. Yeah, from that... Christmas to till New Year's. So they are completely busy. They, okay. they just want to give the time to their families. So. Just but, to give a heads up to you guys, if you're at all you're coming for winter intake, right? Have some money with you, a Canadian yes. money or something, so that you know at least a couple of days it goes by, right? So you don't need to struggle for your uh, uh, basic utilities and basic things. And once you get your DSC open, you obviously get your two thousand uh, yes. uh, or the other monthly. Right? monthly. So yeah. So you are looking at some any part time jobs here? Like yeah, I I edited my resume. Okay, you did I your see, resume. Yeah, I did so. my resume. So uh, you have seen my video, right? Resume yes, video. Yes, yes, I can see your video. <laughs> it helped a lot. Please, guys, check his video. Okay, thank so, you. Yeah, I, I edited my resume. Okay. And now I'm starting to apply for jobs. Um, mm -hmm. I did not go out today because it's quite chilly out there. Yeah, yeah. It's and I'm so I oh, welcome what? to Canada. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. So, uh, 
whatever jobs are uh, I, found, I found online, I started applying them. Okay. I'm gonna go outside to, tomorrow or day after, so and then I, when I go out, I'm gonna just drop my resume so wherever they are hiring. Yeah, that's that's good. So I don't have a particular choose, means I cannot uh, choose which job any I need to do. Yeah, yeah, I don't have anything like that. Yeah, okay. The thing is that, you know, if you're coming for winter, right, it becomes a kind of uh, force that you need to work on some place. Like winters are like they try to reduce the hours of normal existing people yes, yes, also. Yes. So because the, the business will not be that good as in summers, right, they start working like, you know, more people need to work because more people starts to come out of the houses. Whereas in the winters, right, it's always yeah, snowing, guys. It's, it's pain in the ass for everyone. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> so that's that's the reason, you know, uh, it, you know, if you are even a part-time student and if you are coming in the fall also, you might get less hours, right? Mm -hmm. So that's, that's what I'm just letting you know guys how much money did you pay till now um, see like uh, you know your course required like 20 plus lakhs to be yes, paid exactly. so, so now how much did you pay and what are you expecting to be paid you know by your uh, part-time job or something like that do you have any idea on no, that no i paid the first year fee okay first year for around 10 lakhs you yes, paid it right yeah, now okay that was the requirement to apply for an sds visa okay okay so yes i, I paid my first year fee from back in from India. Okay. Now the the rest of the fee is pretty much less when compared to other universities because yeah. it's only twenty five thousand dollars and my first year fee was twenty one thousand dollars with the special yeah, fee plus the semester registration. So there is only five thousand uh, dollars some change or five odd five thousand dollars left. Okay. So I think I'm gonna pay them with my part times. Uh, yeah you can do that and also right uh, just to know you guys, uh, previously Memorial University used to have very low, very low uh, fees, yes. fees. Now they yeah, have they, increased they like, increase, like three times, they increased yeah. like three times. So yes. something like three, three times they have increased, and uh, it's comparatively less. But you know, there is also a disadvantage that we are living in an island, right? We are, yes, not, we, living we are in, not living in the mainland. Mainland, so it's like kind of uh, even an exchange for that, mm. I guess. So. <laughs> one, see, one last question uh, before completing this uh, interview, right? I just want to know, like, uh, do you have any suggestions to the persons, right, new people who is coming to Canada? Uh, can you suggest something for them? So I've just been here for a week, so okay. One suggestion which I would love, love to give to everyone is be prepared for everything. Okay. So you yeah. you'll have a huge difference in culture once you come from India or from any other place. Yeah, yeah. So be prepared for anything or for everything, mm. old or. You will have your house crisis, food crisis, everything, everything. everything. Just like, be prepared, you know, be strong. Don't expect anything from Canada. Yes. You know, take everything. Uh, you know, whatever uh, you exactly. can do, right? So that's what you are saying about. Uh, so thanks a lot, Vamsi, for taking your time and you know uh, giving us an interview. If at all someone wants to, you know, ping Vamsi and uh, know the details more about oil and gas related, I can give Vamsi's uh, Instagram ID in our uh, comment section. Kindly reach out to him if you have any doubts uh, and. Uh, if you have a lot of doubts, we can have one more session with Pamsi so that we, he can clarify all your questions related to that. So thanks Pamsi, thanks a lot. Thanks, uh, thank you. thanks everyone. Uh, please don't forget to like, share and subscribe our YouTube channel. Uh, until the next video, Padre Krishna signing off. Bye.